Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing my unboxing of the Budget by Paycheck workbook and I'm also going to do my monthly spread for November. So let's get right into it. All right, so I got my box over here. I have already opened the box itself, but I'm gonna show you what it looks like. So I did also get these cash totals or this cash breakdown um, stickers, which is so helpful. That way I don't have to be cutting them individually from the workbook and misplace them as I have in the past. So I got this and I also just got the Budget by Paycheck workbook. And she had different kinds of um, designs. Well, she only had one other design. She calls it the paintbrush design. And I got this floral design. And I think it looks so good. I'm going to move my calendar off here to the side. Goodness gracious, I need to clean off my desk. <laughs> Um, but I think it's so cute. Okay, let's go ahead and open this. Let me go ahead and get my scissors. Super, super, super cute. I decided to go back with the Budget Mom workbook because um, for multiple <laughs> reasons, especially because I couldn't find stickers for um, my Happy Planner and also... I was just getting tired of printing out so much paper, friends. So much paper was printed. So I'm like, you know what? I'm just going to keep it simple like I had done in the very beginning and then just do it in this workbook. And I have my friend Jennifer and she's super reliable, always with her stickers. I know that I'm not going to go without any stickers for my for my budget and making it fun. So I know I can trust her. <laughs> so I decided to go ahead and do this. Okay, so I have had the one before. Oh my goodness, that's so pretty. I've had the other one and this is a different, definitely a different uh, material here. I remember the last uh, Budget by Paycheck workbook, it scratched very easily. Actually mine scratched almost instantly and this is definitely more of a like a plump paper-esque cover and super cute on the inside i wish though that she would have maybe let go of these colors and kind of went more with the theme like the floral theme right i mean i guess the blue still kind of matched the this but i don't know maybe just a little lighter but anyways so here we have just the way that she suggests everyone to do things and then our financial plan yearly savings okay perfect so it looks it's just basically the same as the year before but it has the sinking funds in here a different kind i actually like the floral ones that were in the older one this one's just kind of boxes, so I mean, they're okay. Okay, there's a yearly balance overview, bill tracker, medical bill payment tracker. Oh, I need to fill this out. I already have done mine, if you have not seen my previous video where I have restarted my budget. So I got to fill this one in. Medical bill payments, okay. So we are starting with November. So I'm gonna go to the very back. So don't think because you have this that you have to wait till January. Just start whatever month that you're on, right? Okay. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and do this. And I just wanted to see if there's any other changes. I think that she did include a meal prep page in here. Let me look. I thought I had seen a meal prep page in here. Maybe I'm maybe I'm losing it. Maybe I'm losing my mind. Am I losing my mind? Oh yeah, there is. But why is it all the way in the back? That's kind of weird. Hmm, I wish you would have added this in the beginning. But that's okay. Okay, all right, like if the meal prep could have been like on this page or maybe even on this page, I don't know. 
Anyways, <laughs> do you guys like my robe? Oh, it's so cozy. It's super, super cozy. And I'm still rocking my friend's baby shower ring. It's so cute. Okay, I really want one of like those big uh, butterfly rings that uh, Wendy Williams uses. <laughs> it's so funny. Um, it's so beautiful, the one that she has. Okay, I'm going to put you guys just a little bit higher to so get you guys all in the frame. Sorry if it's shaky. Okay, so I have for my setup these um, stickers from my friend Jennifer at Life in Envelopes. And as I mentioned, she's so reliable. And I was going without stickers, um, the other method I was trying to use. And it was just, I just could not do it no more, friends. I could not wait any longer. Let me try to get this open. There we go. Oh, but you know what I forgot? I forgot to buy the big November sticker that goes at the top of there. Dang it. Oh, well. That's, I totally forgot about that. That is okay though. How cute is this? It's so adorable. Anyways, how are you guys doing? I have um, started or I have created an Instagram account for my channel. Um, that way I can keep up with you guys a little easier and I'm not falling behind on what everyone's doing. I kind of felt like that that was what was happening and I was feeling super, super sad about it. I was kind of like being like too harsh on myself. Like I was like, man, I'm not keeping up with what you know my friends are up to. And yeah, I was kind of feeling down and then I decided, you know what, why don't I, I'm like late on this Instagram game. Why don't I go ahead and create an Instagram? That way I can know quicker when people are uploading and get to see what people are up to. So please know that the way Kat uh, lays down the stickers might be just a little bit crooked, but that's okay. Uh-oh. So yeah, so if you have an Instagram account, for your channel, or if you know you just like to watch, oh my goodness, let me know in the comments below. I love to go support you and just show some love on your channel. Okay. Come on, cat, you can do it, you can do it. Okay, there we go. And there we go, perfect. So yes, let me know in the comments below and I'll see you guys on that side. So what day do you guys like starting your calendar? I like starting it actually on Monday and I like having my Saturday and Sunday over here. It just makes sense for me like that. But do you guys put Sunday over here? I mean, it would make sense to put Sunday right over there. Hmm. <laughs> um, maybe I'll do it the way the sticker shows it. Okay, and friends, I'm not that fancy. These are just some extra clippers that I found in my bathroom. <laughs> some tweezers, or they're not actually tweezers. I have no idea what these are for because obviously they're like way too, it looks like way too soft. But are you guys trick-or-treating with your kids? Are you guys giving out candy? This year, with everything going on and buying a house and then REC going out and then having random family visits, um, like we did not buy like any decorations for outside of our home, which kind of made me really sad because I do like to be festive and I do like to decorate, but it just kind of was like way too much this year <laughs> trying to do it all. So if you guys decorated outside, let me know what you guys decorated and how you guys decorated. I have a neighbor that went all out. He literally looks like he bought like the entire uh, display floor at, <laughs> at um, Home Depot. Literally looks like that. So he went all out. And I have another uh, neighbor and he has this projection on his 
house that looks like there's zombies coming out or ghosts. Um, it's actually pretty cool, but it kind of does look scary. But I said, hey, you know what? That's really cool. So, whoop, there we go. How are you guys doing on your budgets? Um, what kind of things or changes are you doing for next year? This is kind of my change for next year. But, you know, since I restarted, this is kind of like my January today. <laughs> today and like for the foreseeable future. So I know for sure I was using the Happy Planner and it was all fine and dandy. But it's just, it almost gets more expensive because then you have to buy so much ink because you're printing out so much paper. And then then your happy planner doesn't fit everything so then you're thinking should i get a second happy planner and then you buy the you need to buy a bigger disc so you can fit everything and then you decide oh i don't know it's just like so so much options it's just better to like if i could just minimize the options that i have and just stick with one it'd be so much make so much more sense for my brain i like to say that you know you can get lost in the sauce of things you know you can try like all the things and you see one person doing something you say hey that's cool and you try to do it and then you try to implementing like way too much stuff that you kind of lose sight of the main thing you know you don't keep the main thing the main thing <laughs> and yeah that's when you get lost in the sauce and like gucci man says you get lost in the sauce and that's exactly what happened i got lost in the sauce of things didn't keep the main thing the main thing Almost, it almost felt like I was, I was being part of a pyramid scheme. <laughs> um, and realized a lot of hurtful things. But I am back. And I feel great. I feel very, 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 very good. And, um... I already gave my family their gifts. I just buy gifts for my uh, immediate family. And we're not really having like a big, like we're not really celebrating the holidays in the sense of like going to visit family or parties, things like that. This year, I had to work really close. Well, I don't get, you know, the extra day off for Christmas. This year, so I'm just going to spend Christmas here at home, which is fine because I love going to Mass, the Midnight Mass. So I get to do that again this year, which was so nice last year. And I am going to go visit my family tomorrow. And hopefully I'll get to see them again soon. But for the foreseeable future, this is kind of our last visit. Um throughout until probably next year if I'm being completely honest because work is about to get pretty hectic it always does during this time and I'm not gonna have the energy or really the time to be traveling since my family does live in a different state but anyways okay and you might be questioning why I'm wearing a robe because it's I just got off of work and I'm in my comfy clothes. I'm in my comfy pajamas. And I'm in this comfy robe. And after this, I'm going to read a little bit. My husband got me some... Um, he got me a Sonic drink. So I'm going to drink my Sonic drink. And it's going to be awesome. So I'm just going to sit back, read. And... Drink my sonic drink, which I actually have right here, but I've been just talking away. There we go. I have not been telling you, and I have not been drinking any of my sonic drink. Do you guys like to read, or do you guys like do you guys like to actual actually read, or do you guys like um, the audiobook? I try the audiobook, but sometimes I'm like. I like my own inner dialogue better <laughs> better than what I like, like sometimes the person who reads it's voice. And sometimes I could be listening to it, but I totally did not hear anything that they said. <laughs> okay, so now we're just gonna put the days of pay. So getting paid on, let me see. 
We're getting paid on the ace. And I love Jennifer's stickers, but I also love that she adds like so much of these little paydays within her stickers and you don't have to buy like more of these stickers. It makes it like really expensive when it comes to stickers. Okay, and we got on the, uh, no, 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 cat. Oh yeah, on the 12th. Okay. Then we also have the 22nd. And the 26th. I really like, now that I'm seeing, it looks like the budget mom added like one, two, three, four, five. She added six columns this time. And I don't remember her doing that last year um, with the last one. So that is super nice. Okay. So let's go ahead and put our bills down. What's your favorite Sonic drink? Do you guys like Sonic? Mine is the strawberry limeade or the ocean water. Okay. So let's go ahead and put down our bills. We'll start over here. I do have a raceable pin. <laughs> this is our mortgage here. Okay. Then we have Apple Music. Uh-oh. Are you guys seeing this? <gasps> My pin has run out of ink. This always happens to me with these pins. Now, I, now I'm remembering why I stopped using these pins. Oh well. I'll just go ahead. Oh, we can use we can use this one I got for my friend, Nicole. Okay, so we got our mortgage. Just gotta be careful I don't make any mistakes. <laughs> I wouldn't be known for making mistakes, right? Okay, we got our Apple Music. We got utilities. Then also Excel Energy and Straight Talk. Okay, next. Okay, we got that. Okay, we got our truck insurance here. Alright, so do you guys do a turkey, ham, or both, or what do you do for Thanksgiving dinner? I have never had really ham until, I'm not sure if it was, no, it wasn't last year, it was the year before that. My husband's uh, aunt, I guess she's like my aunt too, she made a ham, it was so delicious. I had never had ham before on Thanksgiving, and I actually liked it more than turkey, but it was so good. Okay, I got quite a few on this date. Planet Fitness. So, Sonic drinks are definitely my like Achilles heel. I love getting a Sonic drink. I should really minimize it to like one a week. We're going to work on that. Sound, but especially after like a hard day. It just like ah, uh, just like to relax, read a book, and um, drink a Sonic drink just sounds so good. Okay, so we got a lot of bills on this day. Then here we have our student loans. And our internet. And our truck payment. Anything else? Yes. Straight talk. And D L B. Okay. So after I write down all my bills, I like to go ahead and put the next kind of a few days. And it's nice that she put like this extra one, extra, extra one down here. That way I can go ahead and see the future bills as well. So we know mortgage is here, Apple Music, 
Then on Saturday is utilities. Excel energy. Straight talk. Okay, those are the main ones. Okay, perfect. All right, so let me go ahead and get my calcul my calculator, my highlighters. Where are you highlighters? Okay, let's go ahead. Ooh, sorry friends, I'm over here just admiring all my <laughs> my highlighters. Okay, I know I got those. Purple one, green one, purple, green. Okay, I'll do this yellow one as well. Okay, so good news. <laughs> I already paid all of these with a check from last week so i'm gonna go ahead and put up here this was paid with the month before one of my biggest goals is to get a month ahead on all my bills i'm a month ahead on my mortgage and i need about 1500 um to be ahead on all my bills prior okay Next, we got this paycheck, which I will go ahead and just put a dot next to it. So this paycheck is going to be my paycheck, and it's going to cover all of these expenses. It's going to cover ADT, HBO, Planet Fitness, PlayStation, Amazon, this, and oops, Xfinity. All right, now we have, oh, and this has also been paid already. So looking good, looking good. <laughs> okay, now with this paycheck, I am going to, most of it, if not all of it, is going to go towards our mortgage. So I'm just gonna put this right here. Go to our mortgage, and so, and a little bit of it will go to towards our um towards our variable expenses like groceries and things like that. Okay, so you got this paycheck. This is going to cover my student loan, our truck payment, straight talk, this, um, and then it's going to cover Apple Music, Utilities, Excel, and Straight Talk. And then our last but not least bill. There's one, two. Oh, I need another highlighter color. I'm going to do this blue. This is going to go towards our mortgage as well. Okay, perfect. All right, so all our bills are all set up. I am going to go ahead and put things that are, you know, due this month, I guess. Um, what do we got going on this month? Nothing really. I'm going to try to um, do at least, um, what's a good goal? Maybe like, maybe at least have two, two or three. Three no spends a week. I'm just getting back, so I don't want to say I want, you know, a whole, like, two weeks without no spends because I don't want to, you know, disappoint myself. <laughs> okay. Two or three no spends a week. And we're not really going anywhere I can think about. Nope, that is it. So this month I gotta do that. Um, and that's really much it. Okay, goals this month. I am going to do a new challenge, which I'm going to go ahead and post a new video on that. So I got a new 
fitness challenge. Also want to finish two books. And, and I guess I'll put this up here as well as goals is I like to um, track expenses daily would be a really, really, really good start for me. Okay, to do in the month of November is pretty, pretty chill. So I'm just going to put here self-care. Because that's important, taking care of our mental health and make sure that um, we're taking care of ourselves. So self-care, um, I guess maybe even like budget a petty medi. Okay, yep, that's it. It's looking like a pretty chill month for me, which it's crazy to say that, especially on a on a month that a holiday lands on, like a very, very big holiday. Actually, when does Thanksgiving land on? Um, oh, you know what? I need to put this here too for a reminder. Daylight savings. Ends. Okay, here we go. Here's this day's Thanksgiving. Perfect. All right, friends. I hope you didn't mind this long-ish video. I hope you guys have a wonderful weekend. Spend quality time with your family and your friends, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye. Can I feel and motivation? Just a little while a simple question. Can I get closer? Just for motivation.